All right, family, welcome back. So today's question of the day is, if a man is holding back his feelings from the woman, but she is still interested, should she still pursue him? And I'll give you my answer after this. Before I answer this question, I actually have four questions for you, young lady, and it depends on how you answer this question as far as if you should still pursue or you should move on with life. So the first question that I have for you is why is the gentleman holding back his feelings from you? The second question I have for you is what is your end game as in how long are you prepared to stay in a situation like this? The third question is why are you so determined to pursue a person that's actually holding back their feelings for you? The fourth question is, do you think that there are no other men that are interested in you? Now, sis, I want you to think about those four questions before you determine what you are going to do. See, it depends on how you actually answer these questions. After you figure out why he's holding back his feelings for you, does that still make you feel like you want to stick around and wait for old boy to start showing his feelings towards you? Then you have to actually think about, you know what? Okay, so he's already holding back his feelings for, for me, for whatever reason. Whatever reason that you found out about, right? The second question that I ask you is how long you are prepared to stay in that situation or what is your end game? Now, what is your answer to that? If you are prepared to stay for a lengthy period of time, then it really doesn't matter if you pursue him or not and he's still holding back his feelings. It doesn't matter if you decide to stay for a few years around and going through this because for whatever reason that you feel like you need to do it, maybe there are some self-esteem issues that you are dealing with that you don't really recognize that you are dealing with them, but you are dealing with them because none of us really want to hold, um, not hold, none of us really want to stick around for somebody that is not showing us feelings for an undetermined amount of time. So what is your end game? What was your answer to that? The third question that I ask you is why are you so determined to pursue somebody that's not showing you the feelings that you want to be shown? What's going on with you and your thought process here? Why would you want to stay? Why would you want to pursue somebody that's holding back their feelings for you? Because you want, it to, you want to feel like you are wanted and needed and you want for the guy to pursue you as well. And also, truth be told, that if a guy is really into you, he is going to show you his feelings. They might even slip up, right, because he's uh, getting comfortable with you for whatever reason and um, you know he's enjoying his time he's liking the time that you guys are spending together so he's starting to let down his guard the feelings are going to start showing for you so if this particular guy that you want is still holding so tough onto his feelings why would you want to continue to pursue somebody like that you're worth more you're worth more you are you have to know that you're worth more you have to believe that you're worth more. And that actually goes into the fourth question that I ask you, which is, do you feel that there are no other men out there that are interested in you? Because a lot of us have a tendency to stick around in these relationships or situationships, as I put it once before. I have a video on situationships. I will put it down in the description box below. Watch that video. Get some ideas about situationships. Maybe you are in a situationship and you don't necessarily know that this is what you are in. So I clearly define that in another video. But maybe you are in a situationship and for whatever reason, reason you feel that this is what you need this is what you deserve and again subconsciously this is what you're thinking because outwardly uh, with the words that are coming out of your mouth say one thing but the subconscious is is the way that we usually do things or make our decisions based off of our subconscious so 
if you feel that there are no other men out there that are interested in you, then you feel that, you know what, okay, let me just deal with this for X amount of time. He's going to come around. He's going to start to like me. He's going to see what a good person I am. And it just seriously do not work that way. So depending on how you answer these questions, sis, then you can say, you know what, if all of your answers are pretty much in the positive, then you stick around and you hold out and you pursue, oh boy, if that's what you feel like doing. My own personal opinion is that you move on with your life because the guy that is for you is actually going to show the feelings for you that, um, you know, he's not going to hold back these feelings that you need to see for yourself. You're going to feel like you're wanted. You're going to feel like you're needed there. And you're also not going to have to question why he's holding back his feelings for you. Like I said uh, before, a lot of times the actions don't necessarily match up with the words. And a lot of times it's because the man is not really realizing that he has fallen for you or at least is building some type of an attachment with you. So if you're not noticing any of these things and he's like holding super tight to all of his feelings and everything seeming kind of cold, then you have to really, really think about why you must need and want to stay. That's something that's going on with you. It's really not anything that has to do with the guy at this point. It's everything that's going on with you and what's going on in your mind and what you think that you actually deserve. And now it's showing up in you wanting to pursue somebody that's holding back their feelings towards you. So, sis, I hope that this has actually helped you out. If you go ahead and um, just think about these things. Think about these things and don't necessarily make a decision today or tomorrow, but really, really think about why you would want to pursue a guy that is holding back his feelings towards you because seriously when a guy wants you he wants you when a guy wants you there's no question about it when a guy wants you you do not have to question if he wants you and that includes his feelings and he's a, a, we all know that men and women show their feelings completely different but if a guy is interested in you trust and believe sis you will know there will not be a question about if he's interested in you. Just think about it. And if after you answer these questions, you feel like you need to stick around, then do that. But if you feel like, you know what, there's something going on with me, I need to work on me, step away from the situation, work on you, and um, know that this is not a situation that you deserve. All right, family, if you like the video like this, definitely give me thumbs up. If this is your very first time here, you, you make sure you go ahead and hit the subscribe button because here at I Love Me, 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 I am supplying you guys with the tips and tools in order to have happy, healthy, romantic relationships. Don't forget to apply the knowledge that you guys learn here so you can see what's actually going on and it's not something that you have to worry about or think about is this the way it's supposed to be is that the way it's supposed to be i will see you guys in a future video Mwah.